to go on. When you give everything and face that which torments you. Why burn your face? Only to find that it is worse than you could have imagined. Yeah. Why go on? Is it really so weak to ask this? Or are we just so afraid of the honest answer that we do not dare pose the question? Sometimes the answer lies in a memory, a feeling. Oh, but you guys didn't believe a second ago. Oh, there you go. It's in your mind. It's real. It's happening. Go towards it. So my sword is like broken, right? Yeah. And for some reason, I decided to burn my face with it. You know, fashion sense. Maybe I wanted to prove that. Uh, I don't know, it's my, my scar for losing, even though I lost my sword for losing. But I'm kind of going to get what I wanted. I, games like this, I kind of get bummed out when you don't, like, get any visual progression. Like, I get that the arm is kind of visual pro uh, progression. I like getting new swords and new gear, stuff like that. I'm trying to see if there's any of those, uh... Oh man, that's loud. I'm trying to see if I can get any of those, those stories, those... I don't even know what to call them. Those things I gotta stare at. I don't get why they would leave that so open nothing over there. Makes me sad. You gonna give me a new sword, buddy? Is he fighting? He's gone. You would think slow. How could you keep going? How could you keep going? Ignore the pain. I told you it was to trick you. I told you. Where are you going? See, there's nothing to follow. Come on. Viking ships. Before she first met him, she was not in a good place. Just a teenager, but not like the others. Barely functioning, she rarely left the house. Her father's inbell made sure of that. Only occasionally did she venture out on her own, collecting firewood and herbs. Errands out in the Orkney Plains. That was her world. Like this one. Barren. And lonely. Yeah, I'm still looking around for those those things. But I'm not seeing any. But I don't wanna miss any. I know I've already missed one, so it shouldn't matter as much, but Hmm. 
These waves are apparently putting my PC to work. Getting some uh, frame rate drops. Not in the stream, but in the game itself. Yeah, there's nothing there. Got me running around for no reason. Uh, the light is up there, but I see a path over here. Whoa, this is gonna be Senua's mom again? Father? Senua. No, mother. There will be times that you will feel alone and exhausted. Like a strange little fish swimming against the tides of a big ocean. But have the faith to let go and let the tide carry you away. Because the whole ocean is your home. It does not ask you to swim against it. The ocean is my home, huh? To the ocean! Go! Go! He must go! Alright, we'll follow. Face, though. There he was. The lone figure of a boy. He's there. So play under There's the tree. There's a tree? I don't see anything. Oh, she the tree over there. The first time she saw me. To her young eyes, he moved as if dancing. Darkness. She felt a ray of hope. Oh, she's tired again. Whoa. Oh, that is one. Cool. The Northmen tell of a great hero. His name is Sigma. His father's hall was built around a great tree, and one day, Odin comes and thrusts a sword into the tree, a gift to whomever can release it. Many try, but the sword only comes out at Sigmund's touch. His brother-in-law, King Sigir, wants him, but Sigmund refuses him. So King Sigir plots revenge. He invites Sigmund and his brothers to a feast, but when they arrive, they are met with an army, not a warm welcome. King Sigir captures Sigmund and his brothers, steals his coveted sword, and readies them for execution. Is that it? I hate the way that fades. I wish it would like be a sentence, ending sentence, instead of feeling like it left out on a cliffhanger. There's another one. Alright, I want to find that gate. Uh, let's let's do this first. We'll do this. We'll get the gate. But the tree is all the way over there, and I think we need to go to that. Death for Sigmund and his brothers seems certain. But the king's wife is Sigmund's sister, and she begs for mercy, and implores the king to chain them up instead. He agrees. Not for mercy, though. Because he plans an even more cruel and lingering death. See, I feel like he's going away when I try to run. That night, a she wolf comes and devours one of Sigmund's brothers. Oh, jeez. She returns, ravenous, night after night, until only Sigmund is left. Was it Sigmund's sister? The next day, Sigmund's sister sent a servant with honey to smear on Sigmund's face. Oh, come on. You're going to leave it off there? I need to know what happens. Such a tease. Such a really, really good tease. As the 
the she-wolf licks the sweet honey from Sigmund's face. He bites the wolf's tongue. The she-wolf pulls away, but Sigmund holds on. The chains break, and he is free. After his escape, Sigmund lives like us, hidden in the forest. His enemy, King Sigir, believing him dead, as his sister plots revenge. And for vengeance to succeed, even the great Sigmund needs help. So she sends her sons to him. But their blood is weak and corrupted, and they're put to death by Sigmund. So his sister hatches a new plan, one that is cold of heart and pure of blood. Oh, I can't do anything with this right now. Okay. I had to check, though. Yeah, let's just go back down. I'm pretty sure we gotta go to the body first. Or not the body, you know, the blue spirit thing. Rendering all this water is hard work, apparently. Sigmund's sister trades shapes with a sorceress, and in disguise, she lies with her own brother. She gives birth to a son named Sinfjotli. After a time, she sends him to the forest to Sigmund. He tests the boy, and finds him strong and fearless, and so they go to take their vengeance on King Sigmund. Sigir has them buried alive. Nah. Want to hear the end of that story, damn it. Go down there. All right. What's your name? Senua. 
I haven't seen you before. I'm not... I don't leave home much. Oh. Zeno's daughter. I have to go. Wait. Who taught you to fight like that? No one. <laughs> no one? Well, I... I watched you. And... You... learned all of that from watching me? <laughs> you should become a warrior, you know. Me? I'm Dilly. I'm here for the warrior trials. Just come and watch. And bring your sword. You can't put it into words. That moment when you look into the eyes of the one who is supposed to reassure you. Make you feel safe. It only takes an instant. Fear swallows you before you have a chance to make sense of it. And darkness becomes a part of who you are. Did she kill him? Yeah. But her world changed the day the Northmen took him from her. So anyone knows that there's no going back to how things were. That there's nothing to go back to at all. Stay still. Their gods can see into your mind. They will use this power to destroy you. They won't stop me. I can still feel him. Whatever's left of him, they will never let him go. I'm not gonna let him rot here! You're the one rotting here. Leave me alone. You will die here. No! And all your suffering will have been for nothing! Shut up! Need a SWAT. Did he leave you that? Can you see him? You won't believe it. Is he so real? Is he not? You're alone in these mountains. Is that Delia? Nothing lives here. So she knows the tree. So really is this all in her mind? Like this is just her Her town? Or Yeah. Oh, okay. Probably have to come back to that. Oh, everything's running fine now. What the heck? Maybe it was something. Oh, oh never mind. There it goes. Now it's all falling apart. Now it's running fine. And now it's falling apart. Alright. So, there's some stuff down here that I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to take on eventually. Yeah, it must be the ocean. Like, if I look at the ocean, everything goes to heck. Oh, well, not right now. Oh, there it goes. Uh, I don't know. Ooh, rest of the story, please. Sigmund oh, there's one more. ...are being buried alive. Sigmund's sister throws an armful of straw into the grave mound. Hidden in the straw is Sigmund's sword, the gift of Odin. They cut their way out of the grave mound and set fire to Sigir's hall. The king burns to death. Sigmund calls to his sister to come out so that she may live and be honored. She does come out, but only to tell him the truth. That she had slept with him, her brother, to beget a strong avenger. I am not fit to live, she says, and walks back into the fire. No, oh, jeez. Strike vengeance from your heart, Senua, as there is always a heavy price to pay. Here is the end of Sigmund's story. He was a fierce and great warrior who fought many battles. But one day, an old man came onto the battlefield. Although shadowed by a hood, Sigmund saw that he only had one eye. The man raised his spear, and Sigmund struck at it with his sword, but the sword shattered into pieces. Sigmund then knew that this was Odin, 
and thus that victory could not be his. He bowed his head and accepted his end. Dying, he tells his wife that she is with child and that her son will one day make a great weapon out of the fragments of his sword. The sword named Gram. Am I gonna get Grom? Just a broken, restructured Odin sword? Ooh, look at it in there. Gimme, gimme. Okay, so I gotta go back around to all of those. What's happening? Imagine a sword that can slay gods. Its name is Gramr. It was forged by the god of all Northmen, Odin, and gifted to Sigmund, a great warrior. But it was broken. It's important. Can you help me? The sword appears whole, but it is an illusion. It shattered into shards long ago. It is said a great warrior can reforge Grammar by answering the trials of Odin, one for each shard. The rests of the Tree of Death will take you to new lands where you will face the trials. Go to the shard. Go to the shard. The shard. What's the shard? Find it. It's the metal. That's a big ass shard of sword. A king in the north forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust, and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it. It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn, and it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword, Tierving. I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? It feels wrong. Where are we now? Burial mound. Burial mound? Sigmund? It's strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. Oh, it's where Dylan was born? Or buried? Inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death. Because we have no answer for it. But when it comes, it forces itself onto our friends or loved ones. Then comes the reckoning. Can you feel... The dead tonight. Who's there? My name is nobody. Dillian, I'm here. I'm here for the trials. Like when we first met, remember? You gonna light it or what? What's going on with the janky hands? Was that? Huh? Did you hear that? Nothing. Was that voices? Voices. The voices are dead. Not Dillian. Dillian's calling to you. Can you hear him? But you said it wasn't him. Like he's getting further away. Huh? Have you lost him? We're going the wrong way. Shut up. Senua, you remind me of a story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. Her name is Herver, the daughter Herver. of the Berserker, 
born after he was killed. She's a wild, willful child who teaches herself to fight with weapons. When she learns where her father is buried, her only desire is to reclaim the treasure buried with him, but above all, the sword, Tyrvin. Why is that lit? Find another way. It's not working. You have to lose your mind. Where can you go? You're failing. Find another Think. way. Oh, calm down. I didn't. It, so it's a puzzle. I got gotcha. you. You don't recognize it. Don't doubt yourself. You'll never find it. She doesn't recognize it. Yes, you do. You know. She doesn't. Listen for his voice. Listen. I can hear him. Herver disguises herself as a man to join a band of warriors and soon becomes their leader. When they come to the island where her father is buried, her men do not want to go ashore. They say that evil haunts the island and that it is a worse place by day than other places are by night. Fearless, she lands alone. There are many grave mounds and all of them have ghostly flames burning over them. She comes to the grave mound of her father after passing through these ghostly fires as though they were mist. The flames I passed through were real enough. Damn the Northmen to hell. way. It sounds like it came from the right, though. Alright, that one's the same, this one's different. They make me want to know what's in the room. Oh, why can't I run? I feel weird that there was one room that I didn't really light up. I should have just kept going, I guess. Oh, wait, wait. Is this the room? Is this the secret room? Oh, okay, this might have been a secret room that meant nothing, really. 
Oh. Yes. Within the burial mine, Herver calls on her father to wake from death and bring her his sword. She says that it is not seemly for the dead in their grave mines to bear valuable weapons. Her father answers with words of warning. You go to your doom. Baleful runes surround you. You have gone mad. You have lost your mind. Your thoughts are confused. It is dangerous to wake the dead. Like I said, she reminds me of you. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go back the way I came. Go towards the voice. Come in, shut up. Now is that room lit? It is. <laughs> oh, that's a red room. Guess we gotta go in there, huh? I don't like the looks of it. I don't like the looks of this at all. Oh, you were pushing that? I thought that was a lift. What's your fear? Oh, the dark? See the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Boy. The chief said so. No. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said it could be normal. Normal? Yes. No boy is going to save you. No one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you, no. they will turn their back on you. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. No. You will not defy the gods. Oh, jeez. Come, child. Take my hand. Come. Stand up. I am leaving! You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands! Oh no, it rusted. It's not supposed to be able to do that. Alright, one down and like seven more to go or some crap. 
There's more. I know there's more. Shut up. There's still more. I know. It's not going to be easy. Can you do another one? It's too much. Have you got the damage? Okay, there aren't as many as I thought. It's like four more or something like that. Go. I saw once a plague strike northern lands of ice. It was so terrible that not the oldest man among us could remember the like. Hundreds died. The sickness took nearly every person younger than forty and many older. And where dying mothers gave birth, the marks of the plague were on the babes as they came out of the womb. Is that what happened to me? Was I marked as a babe? Where are we? I didn't like it. This place feels. What is this place? It's a swamp. It feels wrong. It feels strange. Donkey. Where is it? All right. Where are we, Where are we going? This is wrong. This has to be wrong. Oh. And there he is. The light. Go towards it. He's in the house. He's going in. He's disappearing. Follow him. Don't let him disappear. Yeah, he's gonna disappear if he, he wants to. He's a grown ass man. It's just a trial. It's just another test. You just have to solve it, and then you will find him. Then you will succeed. Fine. He's so close. <laughs> oh. It's a test. Moonwalking through Make the test. Jeez, that Stand went real deep. She can almost taste it. Do you smell it? No. Don't worry. Not everyone can. <sighs> this reminds me of when I was playing Resident Evil 7 in the VR. It was really creepy because the water was like at my mouth level. Was wrong, something sinister. She begged them to leave, but they just laughed at her. But soon enough, as the bodies piled up, no one was laughing. And they knew that she was not like them. The bridge, it's broken. Fix it. You have to fix it. How are you going to fix it? You can't get down. You have to uh, last time I had to like climb on a boat and then somehow I could fix it. Alright, I'm working on it. Jeez. X on that door. gonna jump for it or what? We got nothing. No hops. Zero hops. The Northmen. Ah, oh, I missed. A I missed a little. Okay. A light shaped like a half. Yeah, I missed one in the last room. House, What's up, Pocket Monster? Around the walls. I once saw the Death Moon appear at a farm, and first the shepherd died, then a guest died, and then the farm hands. And then the farmer and six of his men drowned at sea. That is not the end of it. Because the dead return to haunt the living. If you see the death, then beware. Because there will be death in that house. I don't know what that changed. What you up to today, sir? Uh, I think this... No. That was like that.
That's another one, but that's the one I got to get over this way. Oh, come on. I'm so confused now. see what was changed okay so that was all blocked up and now it's not blocked up okay but what good does that do me maybe oh, oh okay I know I know I get it so now the ladder will return yep I will fix the bridge let's fix it Ah, that's how it worked. Thanks, Tate. How's the trial get to the house? You succeeded. Were those eyes glowing before? No, ma'am, this isn't. <laughs> Breath of the Wild is my weekend game. And the only reason why I didn't get around to playing it this weekend was unfortunately because, well not unfortunately, um, I was working on getting my car up and running, and that took a while this weekend. And then on Sunday, I was not feeling well, um, so I went to sleep early. But I got my car up and running, so I can drive and get home early and start streams earlier. And get home earlier, and sleep in a little more. It's going to be fantastic. Come to me. Where are you? I'm here. I'm right here. Are you in there? Come out if you want. Find him. Oh, I know. You have to find him in the rooms. Focus. <sighs> Fine. Dillian! They're coming for me! Is that coming to me? It looks like it's coming to me. Oh. Oh yeah, that doesn't look good. Is that good? No, that's not good enough. Go, 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 go. Your picks in the play? picks in the play. Yeah, she's crazy, crazy. But I have They've been showing more story on it. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, That's a dead end. That's a dead end. Oh, my God. Oh, that's not fair. That's my second death. The first legitimate death I've ever had. Uh, I gotta do it all over again? Yep, apparently I was on fire. There it is. Huh? It's close, it's close. Move away. Senua, move away. You're dying. You're dying. The burning has begun. The burning. the burning has begun. There Touch the gate. There I am the trying. Place. You can get through. Your voices are crazy. You gotta chill. Okay, he's outside. Go, go, go! Get under there! Where's your 
no sword. Sword broken. I'm dying. Oh. Uh, should have known. So don't go that way. Keep it moving. Gonna go all the way around the way I we came. Shut up. We're moving. We're moving. We're gonna fight. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't duck my throat. Come on. Okay. Okay. Whew. Go. Shanua. What happened? They're blaming me for the plague. They say that I'm cursed. What if they're right? How would they know such a thing? Are they gods? None of us are. They're just people. Good people, but they're scared. They're afraid of what they can't see. Like children scared of the dark. They make up stories to fill the void. It doesn't make them true. What if my father was right? You have to step out of this darkness. Let them see who you really are, like I am. You're not a monster. Without you, this darkness has made me a monster. I wish these things weren't so long. I'm supposed to be switching games in a moment. What if you're wrong? Okay, so maybe there's only two more. There's this one, and then the one on the left there. This is the end. It's just a trick. You've been fooled before. You could be fooled again. You don't know. It's just that game for you. You never know which way it's going to go. The premise of the game about a god of the Northmen called Baldur, the second son of Odin. He was beautiful, good, and wise. She's traveling unto the underworld. He was fair of feature. He spoke fair words. He gave fair judgments. Light shone from him. Only good things were told of him. Yet he was the first of the gods to die. She's traveling to the underworld to save her boyfriend. Who apparently died. And, uh... We're kind of trying to discover why he died and things about her past. Apparently she was locked away by her father because she had something called, like, the rot or she was rotting. I have no idea. And then, uh, yeah, as you saw, he was the only one who, like, got a chance, got a, or got around to getting to know her and seeing that she's not so messed up, I guess. And then after he died, she went, like,
crazy. Super crazy. I see how this is gonna work. The bridge. It's not broken. It's fixed. What happens? The bridge is fixed. The bridge is fixed. The Northmen tell this story about the death of Baldur. It begins with dark dreams. Night after night, Baldur dreams of his own death, and the gods fear for his life. So Baldur's mother makes everything in the world. Fire, water, iron, stone, earth, wood, beasts, birds, serpents, poison. Man, do you know how hard it is to find a good man these, these days? Ah, uh, it's a chained up door. She's not gonna be able to open that. Only Loki, father of Hela, the mistress of death. Is not amused. League of Legends. I don't. I'm not the biggest fan of League, but mostly it's that it's that top-down view, man. Like, I thought that I really didn't like MOBAs, but it apparently wasn't the case. I like Paragon. I just don't like... Just don't like that that way of doing it, I guess. I think it's the top-down that messes me up the most. Alright, let's see if we can find this pattern. But enjoy. Enjoy League of Legends. Go through it. No, it's something. not because of the high res, it's no. because of the aspect. Darkness and I don't like the the top Blair down and click to run away levels. thing. Like clicking to clicking to run away and clicking to shoot, to it was really awkward and, and annoying. Color stretching away from the gloom. And Senno explored new paths into the unknown. Can I just open oh I can open this door. It's not that League of Legends looks bad. It doesn't look bad. Why are you typing in all caps? Do you remember and at least Smite not trip. have that? I wanted to try Smite too, I haven't gotten around to it though. And it's because I played uh, Paragon before I played Smite and I think that... I'll probably stick to that. Oh, here we go, there's another one. Do you think she remembers him? The gods feast and rejoice. And I'm not really looking to play a lot of MOBAs. And stones at Baldur, striking at him with sword and axe. But he comes to no harm. Whatever they do, the gods never see. Oh, Jesus, stop the voice. Oh, we can't get in this way? What was the point of this then? Dark, dark. 
they're both made by high res oh I didn't know that was the name of their studio I thought you were just saying I like I liked it because better graphics I thought that's what you were trying to say Man, what the heck? I thought I had this all licked. I have no idea. I guess I do have to go back in there so I can trigger the door. He led you astray. You should have listened to your father when you had the chance. Why didn't you listen to him? This love has tortured you and it tortured you. What's up, Jim? I'll be ready to play in a bit. I just wanted to finish up this section. Oh, there it is. I found it. I found you. That has to be it, right? Or do I have to do it from the window? That's that's definitely it. That's that's definitely the symbol that you want. There we go. Senwa, you've got it. Why isn't it close? Dillian believed in you. He's gone. He's in the dark world. He's gone to the dark he world. He cared in a way that nobody world. else did. All right. We're going to be playing Borderlands. Come on, open. Blind god, Hood, was there. Loki asks him why he wasn't taking part. Hood says, I cannot see where Baldur stands, and even if I could see him, I have no weapon. Loki replies, Here is a wand. I will tell you where he stands. And Hood throws the mistletoe at Baldur. It pierces through him, and to everyone's horror, was it worth it? Baldur is killed. Alive and, is dead. and for this, Hood is slain. The Northmen tell how the gods mourned Baldur. His body was to be burnt on his ship, but they could not manage to push it into the sea and sent for a giant egg. Oh, another one? Damn it. She comes riding a wolf and has vipers for her reins. She pushes Baldur's ship. passed since she left her father. She trained hard alongside her friend, Dillian. She saw things no one else could. Patterns, shapes, no. movement. An intuition that made her an exceptional warrior. Friendship turned to love. But the shadow of darkness never let her go. And she was caught between two worlds. That of Zinbel and her past. And Dillian. Her future. Two realities tearing at her soul. I like the Telltale. It was cool. I didn't play it, but I watched some of it. I eventually want to play it. Your curse has clapped. No time for this. Speed is Uh, I hope the last trial is quicker. Oh, I didn't see this. All these voices trying to cast doubt. 
without these trials, I wouldn't have a... Uh... Oh, there goes one. Without these trials, I wouldn't have a damn sword. Aw, oh, don't tell me I gotta be facing the other way. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta be facing the other way. So how do I push that down? Oh. Overcome with grief, the gods send Hermod to ride to Hell and ask Hela to let Baldur return to All the gods are weeping, he says. Are they? asks Hela. We shall see if he is truly missed. If everything in the world will weep for him, he shall go back to the gods. But if even one thing refuses, Baldur stays with me. The gods send messengers everywhere. Damn it. Weep for Baldur. Weep him out of hell. And everything wept. Men, beasts, earth, stone, What trees, about Batman? Metal, everything. Except for a giant ass they find in a cave. Baldur was never my friend, she says. Let hell keep what she has. The Northmen say that the giantess must have been Loki in disguise. And the Marvel one isn't out yet, is it? I'll probably play the Marvel one, even though I'm not the biggest uh, fan of whatever. What's the name of it? Of your Heroes of the Galaxy, Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah, not the biggest fan of Guardians of the Galaxy, but I did like the movies. Um, so I'll probably play it. I still need to finish the Batman one. See where this mark Words. is on there. But it doesn't mean anything. You can't it's a fake one? Language. You don't understand. Zinbel was right. You're wasting time. You're cursed. Um, I don't care about the Minecraft one. But the Batman one just came out with a new chapter. What do you mean by it's old? Yeah, they didn't let me go back, so I won't be able to get them all. Oh, there he goes. Now he's talking. So venom would drip on him. Each time the venom drips onto Loki's face, he writhes in agony. The Northmen say that is the cause of earthquakes. A reminder, perhaps, that if even gods must accept death, oh, there we go. And so must we. Remember, Dillian. Do you remember? Do you remember the sound of his voice? Where was the door? Is it down here or is it up there? No, it's down here. Alright, man, no problem. Has D A T D M? Lillian never much cared for the underworld and looked dimly upon the druids like her father, Zinbel. I guess he took after his father, a chieftain who believed nothing he couldn't see, and he happened to be blind. She felt safe in Dillian's arms, had to see the world through his eyes. Dan, TDM. Slowly, the darkness that had bound her so tightly began to unravel. 
Team Deathmatch? I, I have no idea what you're referring to. Glad you got your hands in there, buddy. Wave them like you just don't care. Oh, jeez. She scared the hell out of me when she screamed. I thought he was running at me or something. Whew. Oh. What's up? Your father cannot understand your darkness. He cannot see through your eyes. No one can. The diamond wine cart. My own father was born blind. Doesn't have the faintest idea of what the night looks like. <laughs> the word dark to him means as little as the word light to me. So someone is afraid of the dark. Should we fix them by taking away their sight? No. But you give up the beautiful world. You. Only you can see just to be rid of your nightmares. What the hell was that? Oh, thank you, Cupid. <laughs> Wish this the price you pay. You would be too you easy. They're taking your memories to torture you. They're taking your gift that makes you so special in Disappearing one memory after another. Just another point. Every time you remember, it disappears. They're going to take everything. They're not yours anymore. They're going to take everything you have. The memories of ghosts. And they belong to the gods to protect you. They're eating you from the inside. They want to kill you. They want to crush you. They want your body. They want your soul. They want your mind. And they're going to take it. The memories were yours, but they're the gods now. Nothing is yours anymore. All right, one more, and then we get the sword. I believe this is the last one. I don't think there was any more when I was running around. Yeah, this last one. The Northmen say that their all father, Odin, gave his eye in exchange for a drink from Mimir's well, the well of wisdom. In blindness. There can be wisdom. I have no idea Only what the by giving can you what that is in return. For this reason, Welcome I give back, Jim. my life and pass on my stories of the Northmen to you, Senua. Where am I? <laughs> I can't see. Yeah. Like knowing what your issue is is part of the pro or part of the solution. So at least you're almost there. Can you hear me? And at least you got it working, I should say. Make them printed in dark blue, whatever it is. Can't you see me? Help me. Breathe slow. It's the darkness. Stay still. Empty your Tell me what you feel. The breeze. Good. Then there is a way out. I can't tell where it comes from. Yes, you can. So what, I follow her hand or something? Nope, don't follow her hand. Apparently not. Okay. Oh, the rumble. There's a rumble. The others. The voices. They've gone. I'm still here. It's so quiet. Yeah, when I was in it's college, so I used to just change it to okay. dark blue and print it that way. Listen to you I figured that. when I was in elementary school, they would accept blue and black ink, right? Feel it rise and fall. And no teacher has ever said anything. It was dark enough blue to where it didn't, didn't seem different. And fear. Let your senses guide you. Go on. Will you? 
find a way. I'm not leaving you here. Dillian, damn it. Help me out. Uh Okay. No. There we go. It's a cool little mechanic, but it kind of sucks because once you get to a corner, you have to... Oh, I get why that would happen. I guess air does blow off a corner and would turn. So you'd have to turn again to feel the air rushing at you. Hour... Hour of darkness. Use all of your senses. Let the world speak to you. Never heard of that. What do you hear? Upstream? Upstream. Okay. So sorry. I thought I left this all behind. Don't be sorry. It's not your fault. It is my fault. That's ah. right. It's inside of me. It won't let me go. Shadow. Oh, okay. The first the sky game. Why you would you taught me that the hardest battles are fought in the mind? You're talking about mid-boss. No coward. You proved that to me in the warrior trial. This is just another battle. You can beat it. This isn't so bad. You don't have to help me. I want to. Besides, you Whoa, that's to a body. Is in mid boss the vampire? That's what they would call him all the time. Well, that's what Laharl um, would call him, mid boss. He wouldn't let him have his name. Seems there's no escaping the past in this place. So she's forced to relive it. Adonis is the mid boss? I swear it was the. I don't remember who Adonis is though. I always remembered uh, the vampire dude would come out and he'd have the whole count voice and everything and he would always call him mid boss. Now you're gonna make me look this up. Yeah, I'm fucking right. Who's Adonis then? I guess his name is Adonis. So then who is the guy you're talking about? This game, me... What is it? Me... Mer, Maduras. Okay. Maduras. Oh, I... F oh, okay. Never mind. I thought you were... Is he even a main character? I don't even know who that guy is. I don't remember. Is the vampire the second? I don't even know what that means. I kind of like this part. It's really cool. Having to feel around for the wind. Leave it behind. And their eyes are so wide open as they would be.
Oh, there's no more breeze. So I guess I'm just walking towards light again. Something moving over there, though. There's a lot of things moving over here. Oh, crap. I'm guessing I don't want these things to touch me, right? I think they're moving. You're breathing too fast. I'm scared. This is the sound of your breath. In and out. In. And out. Yeah, I don't like the looks of these creepy ass things. See? I was not expecting. Okay. You can do so. I've never used him. I've never used him as a character. So he's a created character. Um, well, yeah. Custom character. Or maybe he's not. I have no idea. Because you gave him a name, so that's why I'm confused. Or was that... That's his class type? Is that what he's called? I don't know. I don't, <laughs> I don't remember him. I didn't use... Actually, you know, that's kind of fair. I don't use the monster classes in... Uh, in Disgaea too often. I, I don't like them. Um, I think in the third game, I used the wolf as a sword for the most part, and that's about it. But other than that, I don't really care for the monsters. Death. The darkness is testing you. You are in control. So he is a boss. Mm. Yeah, I don't remember him. Well, there's a well. Don't turn back. You're getting close. Jump. Jeez. Like, kind of remember what he looks like. Like, when I saw him, he looks familiar. But, like, I don't remember what he sounds like. Or any of his quirks. Oh, crap. Do I just have to keep walking? I guess I'll just keep walking. Man, this game is so much better than I thought it was going to be. I mean, I guess I haven't played the game in a very long time either. Like, I played the game back when it first came out on PS2. But still, I mostly remember Laharl, Edna, and Midboss. Days even, trapped within herself. were open, but you were gone. And when it finally let her go, she could be anywhere, with no memory of how she got there. Oh, don't make me do another part. When it comes back. Oh yeah, I forgot about Flown. I do remember Flown. But here, for the first time, or Flown A, someone whatever. was there to help. But I heard your voice. Oh jeez. You found your own way back. 
All you needed was a little help. Is this whole thing gonna turn out to be like her on her deathbed? Like dreaming all of this? Sort of dreaming all of this? Because it's weird that this tree would be here, this tree that she supposedly met uh, Dillion under. Grammar reforged, you will have Odin's blessing to walk a goddess into the halls of Helheim and challenge Hela as an equal. So Dillion was helping me. I do remember Hogmiser as well. To him. Like when we first met. Why couldn't I just... Uh, I gotta go all the way around to get up there? Yep, I passed it. Give me that sword! Dillian gave her the strength to pass the warrior trials. And she saw a way out to leave her past behind and become a warrior in Dillian's clan. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. The sword is tainted by the gods of darkness. Leave it. No. He left it here. He wants me to take it. You will pay a price for this. Oh no. I wanted it to stay glowing. It looks badass. Years later, with Zinbel's parting words still haunting her, did Zinbel die? Came back with a vengeance. A plague. Tony? Everyone suffered. My father was not supposed to die like this. The suffering you've caused. This is your fault. <laughs> you brought this plague to us. <laughs> you have blood on your hands. I want to know if she killed Dillian. They're coming for you now. They're coming. Oh, come on. The mirror, her focus is quiet. It's coming. You're so sword just the fact that you can make it glow <laughs> it's nearly over Finish it. I'm very simple man I like glowing swords Focus. makes me happy Over the ones I love. Oh damn! Look the at her neck turning. Under them, ah. The ship that had sailed from the land of shining fields. Their memorial stone is sacred. Come not here in the sun. Come not with a sword. Come not crying over a naked corpse. <laughs> Come not with disturbed mind. Um, she cannot 
not come with a disturb bind. That's all I'm saying. All right, but that's it. That's where I'm going to end this, and it looks like we can probably finish this up tomorrow. So I'm going to stop here, um, and then I'm going to be back in a little bit to play some Borderlands 2. Um, D2, I actually never played, you know? So I never got to try the mounts and demon fusion. And I think D4 is the one that had the ones where you, you would put them together and they become gigantic. Uh, but I really like the magic change and the giant stuff, but I just never used it. It just... The game was too grindy. And I never kept up with the monsters. Like, I always, I always liked the... The humanoid class is a lot more than I like the monsters. But anyway, I'm going to switch off. And uh, I should be in Discord in a little bit, Jim. But thanks for everybody who came to watch some uh, Hellblade. I'm going to switch games. I'll be back.